How we doing everybody? This is That Our Nerd coming at you with a quick video on how to reorder the bars when you're doing a GG plot uh, by count or whatever you want. Uh, so, the package that we're going to be using is obviously GG plot 2. We're going to be using a data set out of the data sets packages. I think that just auto loads every time you do R, but in case not. Let's load the datasets library. So the data set that we're going to be looking at is the MT cars data set. And what we're going to want to do is we're going to want to look at how many different cars are there uh, with a four, six, and eight cylinder. Okay. And so we're going to want to plot that one bar for each number of cylinders. So we'll do MT cars and pipe it into a ggplot and what we're going to do is aes x is equal to sil and then we're going to put that in a geom bar without a zero in there uh, so this is what it looks like at the beginning there's a few things uh, how it's numeric it shows like three and five and seven and nine which we're not interested in so the first thing we'll do is we'll call this a factor and that will make it so we just have four, six, and eight. Uh, but then what we want to do is we want to arrange it, right? And so for the first one, we'll do, we want the smallest, medium, biggest. So we want six, four, and eight, right? We want to reorder these bars. And the best thing for this is uh, actually the reorder function. So we'll say reorder. We'll go after the cylinder here and put a comma. And the second part is what we want to reorder it with. And so we're going to use cylinder. And then what we want is we can put a function in here. So we'll say function x. And then the function we want to use is the length of x. All right, so what this is going to do is it's going to reorder cylinder by cylinder. And it's going to take the length of x, and that's how it's going to reorder it. And so the length is just going to be this count that it has over here. And so this should get us to uh, smallest to biggest. Unless I butchered it somewhere. <laughs> Excuse me, which is highly likely. I didn't put a uh, ending parenthesis there. That's a lot of parentheses, if you ask me. So let's uh, escape out of this. That ain't it, chief. Escape. There we go. All right. So we're back. Let's let's run this again with that closed parenthesis. All right. So now now we have smallest to biggest, right? So our six cylinder, four cylinder, and eight cylinder. We can also flip this, right? Sometimes we might want the biggest one first and the smallest one at the end. And so all we have to do for that is put a negative, negative length. And so now it's biggest to smallest. And then just to make it look better, just to finish it off here, let's put some labels on it. So for our X, we'll just put our cylinder. And for our Y, we'll put a capital count. It just looks better with a capital, you know? All right, it's beautiful, there it is, reordered bar charts in R. If you enjoyed this video or found it helpful, make sure to press like so that other people can find it. Uh, subscribe to this channel if you want just the best R content that there is ever. And uh, you have a good day. Thanks for stopping by and watching.